Oh my <laughs> goodness. If you weren't hungry before, you're going to be now. But that's okay because we're going to solve that problem for you. Yeah, it looks like we're already done. <laughs> We've got a fully cooked chicken here, but we are far from done. Tide and Tide food blogger Laura Davis joins us hey in guys. the Delmarva hey Life Del Kitchen. Marva. What's up? Happy New Year. Happy New Happy Year New to Year. you. So we're, you're going to show us how to make a chicken salad. A chicken salad. I thought, um, you know, with New Year's resolutions, I know one of mine is always trying to do better on my meal planning and mm -hmm. cook more at home. You know, it's easy to call and take out even for somebody like me who you know does it kind of for a living so one thing <laughs> I always do is get a chicken at the grocery store one or two with yeah. three boys growing I mean they're really starting to eat so a lot of times I'll go for the two for pack mm -hmm. um, and I will roast it at home just a little olive oil and salt and pepper on top 425 for an hour and I mean to eat chicken one night and then to use the next one mm -hmm. for anything. Yeah. Just delicious chicken salad, chicken enchiladas we've made on Ooh, here before, yeah. chicken tacos. I mean, the possibilities are endless soup. Yeah. Um, and today is a, a special day, so you decided to go that right, avenue. Right, but I thought today we would do the my spin with the apricot basil chicken salad. It's Yeah, because it, it's it, National Apricot Day, y'all. I amazing. did my homework, I knew I was coming, and I said, incredible. let me do, let me see if it's a food <laughs> holiday, which pretty much every day is, if yeah. you really go looking mm -hmm. for it. Today is Apricot Day. Now it doesn't get as much attention and cred as something like Oreo Day, but <laughs> apricots are just as fabulous. All so right, well let's get to it. What do we need to do? To it. Um, you want to go ahead and get started making the dressing. You want to shred this chicken down. Okay. Um, we'll leave that one whole and beautiful. This right, is right. Um, the breast meat that I had just taken from the other one that I roasted last night. Okay. So just shred it down. So I kind of like still like bigger shreds, not too finely oh, okay. shredded. Right. You want them to know it's Nice chicken. chunks of chicken. Yeah, okay. yeah. <laughs> All right. Stuff. So what do we? What so are we, we get have here? about a half a cup of mayonnaise. Oh, mm -hmm. here, here's your oh, spoon, okay. like spatula, whatever you want to call it. A half a cup of mayonnaise. Let's go ahead and get that in the bowl. All right. You could just do all mayonnaise, but I like to lighten it up a little bit mm -hmm. with Greek yogurt. Greek so yogurt. So let's yep. add a little bit of that. And this is just uh, unflavored Greek yogurt. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, let's stay away from the vanilla or the peach or anything. All right. Like that. Um, some honey. We're just talking about honey. Yeah. Some, about a tablespoon of that. Some. That's looking good, Jimmy. And then a little spoonful of Dijon. If you don't have Dijon, you could use uh, yellow mustard or whatever. It doesn't make it taste mustardy. Just Is that a enough? little bit. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. And then a, a little celery seed. I love celery Do seed you, so just much. Just pinch it or all this. Uh, Add all of it. All huh? of it. Why not? You know, celery seed, I do too. My mother uses celery seed oh for gosh. dressings. Potato and salad. And yeah. I always said that if I had a DJ name, it would be DJ Celery Seed. Oh, I okay. Love it. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Guess Done. what we're going to call you? Yeah, from that's on. from that's now gonna on. going to be on the title. It's going to be on your little name banner there. Yep. <laughs> so I've got an onion here that I've chopped really finely and a few stalks of celery, pretty much essential mm -hmm. uh, chicken, your standard chicken salad ingredients. That's plenty mixed. Okay. Let's see. You want to swap you it over here, and Jimmy can start tossing your chicken in there. Tossing my chicken in? Is, is this the size that you're wanting? Yep, that's some, some, beautiful. Something big enough mm -hmm. and yet shredded at the same mm -hmm. time. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Lisa, you want to chop the other half of this onion here? Oh, sure. But if I start crying, I'm going to give it back to you. Okay. <laughs> there you go. All right. I'll take the knife. Oh, there you go. I'm not a, <laughs> I'm not a, a fast shredder. I, I hope you weren't looking for quick shred there. I'll help. Yeah, I think the best way to shred chicken is just with your hands, right? Yeah, you know, I was gonna bust out the mixer. That's another trick. You could mm -hmm. take your chicken and put it in the bowl of a standing mixer with your paddle attachment uh -huh. and put it on for like 30 seconds on low. But you gotta watch it because you'll get a super fine shred really quick. It's, oh, it's yeah. like more of a chicken mash, which is fine for some things like a dip. But I, for salad, like I said, I like these big chunks. All right. All right. Dump that in. That's a lot of onion. Maybe like half ski on that. Okay. Half -sy. Yeah. Boom. Boom. All right. All right. So we're going to get ready to mix this together, okay. right? Okay. We're going to, yep, I'm going to finish up. I'm going to chop up our apricot and our basil, and we'll throw that in and mix it up and give it a taste when we get back. I have fancy croissants. All right. Or croissant. We'll be back with DJ <laughs> Celery Seed. Woo! Stay with us. <laughs> That's good. That is what is going to be apricot 
chicken salad. We are in the Delmarva oh, oh, Life oh, Kitchen oh, with oh, Tide oh, Time oh. food blogger Laura Davis. And you, while we were in the commercial break, you very quickly cut up all those apricots. Just, right? Uh, basil. About a half a cup of apricot, mm -hmm. um, nice handful of basil, and we're going to add, which I, that's not in the recipe title, but there are slivered almonds in there, which Ooh. I think is a great crunchy um, addition. So you want me to put all that in yeah. there? Awesome. Okay. Yeah. Okay. As I many as you'd it. like, or you could do walnuts, or you know, any. Uh, I'll do cranberries and walnuts and rosemary instead of this, and mm -hmm. that's another great combo. You see that more though. Yeah. Mix it up. Mix it up. Yes, ma'am. Give it a mix. Hopefully, you know the dressing situation. You adjust accordingly. Sometimes mm -hmm. you might need a little bit more, but I think it's better to err on the side of too little at first than right. too much, because you can always go back and. Words there's of nothing wisdom. Words of wisdom directly from DJ Celery. <laughs> right, so. there you go, there you go. Um, I bought these beautiful croissants. Yes. But it's good on a bed of salad greens. It's good on regular sandwich bread, however you want to do it. It's okay. delicious on everything. I'll let you finish that, that out looks there. Perfect. That's yeah. perfect. Yeah. We well, should have had we salt and pepper. I forgot those, but oh, we'll just that's pretend. okay. You yeah. don't even, it's so you much fun. You don't, don't, need, don't, even don't need, need it. it. Salt's bad for you anyway. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and spoon some on there. A little bit from our beautiful lettuce. I know. I almost here. hate to, for you to take lettuce that, out of that. That might go bowl. home and be the centerpiece on our dinner table tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Lisa, do you like your chicken salad thicker or, or, or thin or? Uh, just like that. Just like Perfect. that. Awesome. Yeah. Lettuce, yay, nay. Yeah. Well, yeah. How Makes it not? even healthier. Beautiful. Now, Lisa, I know that you are a cheese lover. Yep. See, I'll be honest. I would put a slice of cheese on this too. You could. Well, what, I mean, what would you suggest? Float, what would you put on here? Whatever floats your boat, Jimmy. I think <laughs> you need a little bit more, though. Come on. Yeah. You're looking for me to spread <laughs> it all over myself when we bite it, huh? Come yeah. On. Okay. All right, that's, that's <laughs> and if you would like the recipe, send us a self-addressed stamped envelope oh, oh, oh. to 1729 North Salisbury Boulevard, Salisbury, Maryland, 21801, or you can go to our website, DelmarvaLife.com. That is a good-looking sandwich right there. That is good-looking. Time to, to eat it. To, so, so say the name of it again. This is a croissant. <laughs> no, <laughs> you, wait, you got apricot. You oh, got oh, the apricot <laughs> basil mm -hmm. chicken salad. Mm -hmm. Apricot basil almond chicken salad. Dropping it on you. Mm. DJ celery seed, fresh beets. <laughs> <laughs> Between between the almonds and the lettuce, I really do love the. Yeah, the it is to good, it. and with the with the little bite of sweetness from mm -hmm. the apricot, mm -hmm. it's um it's really good. And apricots are so good for you too, mm. especially dried. It's all kinds of good stuff. So, good stuff. Good Thank stuff. you so much. Thanks again for having me. You guys. bet. Mm -hmm. We love it when you're here.